Salsa. Do you You've have... heard of wine tasting, but have you heard of salsa tasting? I want to go to a salsa vineyard. Do they, is there a salsa vineyard? I don't know. Maybe we should create one then. There's oh, not. Right. Mm, that's a good idea. Uh, well, we should have a pen that idea. <laughs> Nobody can see that. No one can oh, take it. Mm. So we're trying sauces, guys. Trying sauces. I'm going to die. And I believe these are all locally Texas salsas. I don't. I can neither confirm nor deny. Exactly. I know nothing about these salsas. Neither do I. I haven't tried any of them. Never seen them. Didn't purchase them. <laughs> I don't really like the look of this one. There's a lot going on in there. A lot of chunks. It keeps uh, kind of greenish. Yeah, it does have like um, a good green tint to it. This one looks a little bit like Tostito salsa. Like the chunkiness. Oh, cool. Yeah, all Texas based. Because mm. you know why? Texas is number one. So our first one up is going to be this little piggy. 1893 salsa. That's what it's called? This little piggy? Yeah. This oh, okay. Little piggy. Interesting. Made with real sugar. Oh, made with. <laughs> I said real. Made with pride in sugar latex. Mm. Oh, okay. So pretty little to us. This little piggy. It's called this little piggy because it has bacon in it. That would be awesome. Or bacon grease. Ooh. This smells. Ooh. Familiar? It smells like beans almost. Like charo beans? Yeah. No way. No yeah, way. No way. No yeah, way. Ah, uh, no smell way. Smell that. I got nothing. Smell that seat. I don't know why you took it. <laughs> Cause oh, you I see it. what you mean. It does smell like charo beans. Like the pepper, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Mm. Does it have beans in it? It's gonna be awesome. Mm, um, just bacon. It says it's so good, we're gonna be squealing in the light. Squeal, squeal. Wait, let producer Vic smell it. Or you can smell, smell that. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh, yeah, yeah, y'all are right. It, right, it's like straight up chowder beans. If anybody, if y'all don't know what chowder beans are, Google it. Uh, I don't see any beans on this, but I'm just nah. saying. Nah, there shouldn't be two beans in it. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Hey, don't cough all over our I sauce. Question. Right. right. I'm comfortable. Do y'all prefer a chunky salsa or maybe like a more pureed salsa? Like know. a smooth salsa? I'm a puree guy. Same. I think it depends if I'm eating it with chips or am I eating it on food. Okay. If it's, a ch if it's for chips, I kind of like it chunky. If it's like on tacos, I like more of a pureed, saucy, yeah. well, you know? Okay. Not watery, but you know, just that. Yes. Well, Something just, that's not chunky. I would describe yeah. this one as chunky. Yeah, a little bit chunky or something. Just because, like, on chips, I kind of want to make it feel like I'm eating something. I mean, if it's just smooth. What? I'm sorry. Allergies? Cover your I didn't even, nothing came out. I you don't know that, you don't know that, you don't know that. The camera got particles. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Either fucking die or try he to He tried so hard. <laughs> My mouth is completely closed. Your nose is still open though. It's going down. Mm -hmm. Oh, anyway. I aim it. Anyway. He almost squealed like a pig. Ready to try these chato right. salsa? I'm ready. Right. Chato salsa. Cheers. The corn feels like taro beans too. That's pretty good. A little sweet. It's sweet. But you know what? That could be the bacon and the chow beans. Mm. I can see some garlic in there. I yeah. hope there's garlic in there. This is what it tastes like. Garlic, chipotle. Definitely tastes like there's some chipotle. You know, I can see myself taking this salsa and pureeing it some and putting it on some meat. Mmm. Mm. Tastes good. I think this is a chip. I don't know. I think if you puree it, you're not. I don't know. I don't know. I don't have nothing. I don't know, it's worth a try. It's worth, yeah. What would you put this on though? Tacos? Me, yeah, I feel like fajita tacos, fresh off the grill. Mm. This is more like barbecue, in my opinion. Yeah, yeah. I got I more of a barbecue taste to it. It's probably because of the sweetness. That yeah. It's the, yeah, it's yeah, the sweet. sweetness that kind of like, I don't know, on tacos, I kind of want like more, for fajita, I kind of want something more like, like the spicier side. You know, I, think, I, I mean, that's just, that's just me. I'm sure. Maybe. Yeah, this thing is labeled as hot, and I mean, it has a nice little kick to it, but... Maybe it has some chicken tacos, but... Oh, mm -hmm. I don't know about beef. What kind? As a salsa... Overall, as an overall salsa. As an overall salsa, I'll give it... I'll give it a four. I think the flavor is really good. 
Uh, it has a, again, it has a nice little kick on the spice. Definitely, you can see all the, you know, all the ingredients they use. So you like to see all that freshness in there. Mm -hmm. um, but it's the sweetness that is taking it. That's not big. That's the reason why I'm not giving it a five. All right. I just, I don't think salsa should be sweet. Should be sweet. Yeah. Yeah. At all. Mm -hmm. So four. Yeah. I'm gonna give it a three. Kind of like on the same basis as Soundtrack is that. Well, me just, I, I like my sauces, not like too overly spicy, but just a little bit more of a spice to them. And I think it's missing that. And it's, I don't know, it's just a little bit too sweet. And yeah, I, I also I can't, I really don't know what to put it on. Like, oh, kind of chips. <laughs> yeah, put it on chips and eat it. Well, besides that, I gotta give it a three. three. Overall taste was, it was there. It was good. It was not, it's not bad. It's not unpalatable. Yeah, it's not bad. Uh, not unpalatable. I could sit here and eat it with chips all day, but why, the reason why I'm giving it a three is because it was advertised as bacon, and I just don't taste bacon. I get sweet, I just don't yeah. taste bacon. I think that's kind of, maybe that's what they're referring to as bacon. Yeah. Sometimes bacon can be sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, is like that it's, it's maple bacon? I feel like that. in the smell of there. I mean, you can see the pieces, but. I don't think it was ever meant to be a bacon salsa. It's just a salsa that happens to have bacon in it. All right, well, Chad, what's our next one? Uh, let's go with this one. This is just closer. <laughs> We're doing red ghost pepper salsa. By the way, does anybody know how to dance salsa? No. So I don't know what to talk I mean, not for real, but you're on how to move. I know the moves. I move my hips, do a little footwork. I got it, I got it. No. I said it. Blessed with rhythm or sense of smell. <laughs> Sorry. You weren't blessed with a lot of things, buddy. I know. <laughs> Wanted for the best salsa, Red Revival has been confirmed. A s approach with chips in hand. Reward. That doesn't make sense. Award winning salsa in every jar. Okay. But by the smell, I wouldn't say this is spicy, but I mean, you never know. <laughs> it smells. Uh, yeah, this smells almost like a spaghetti sauce. Yeah, like a marinara sauce, right? Like. I get a lot of tomato on that. Yeah, All right. right. And Cheers. Cheers, guys. It tastes just like it smells. It really does. Like, is it spicy? No. Uh, it's a little spicy. Come <coughs> Pepper, yeah. Okay. Pepper. okay, you can't say it's not spicy no more. <laughs> After that, <coughs> it's die already. That was more chip. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, it's a lot. It's a little sweet. That's a cake to it. To me, I would say it's probably spicier spice. than that. Oh, it's definitely spicier than this. Yeah. To me, it's not ghost pepper spicy. Right. Yeah. And it's probably because they used a lot of tomato and really like dwarfed it down. Yeah, I think they did that to make it palatable. So that way you're not just, I'm eating it for the sake of saying I ate something spicy. You're actually eating something you can, if you're going for that tomatoey taste and still peppery spicy, you can enjoy that. Visually, it looks like Tostitos mild salsa. Yeah, it almost smells like it too, but... Yeah, you see like pepper flakes. Yeah, and also you can just look at it, because versus this one, you see all different colors of things, and that one is just straight red. All right, so if, if you were to puree, puree that further, could you puree that further and put it like on your tacos and stuff? That one, that one more and than... Enjoy the, it and enjoy it, yeah. More than the other one, yes. Oh, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm just curious, because that might go into your judging criteria. Mm -hmm. But I'll kick this off, and I'm going to give this one a four. Um, spice was good, taste was good, palatable. Nothing, nothing we need more said. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, I'm going to go with a three. You going with a three? Still, I like the spiciness. I just don't like the overpowered of tomato. <laughs> Like too tomato -y for you. It's like it's a salsa should should have more than basis of tomato and more flavor and that's just I don't know, just it's like a spicy tomato, which is weird. Okay. Yeah, yeah I pretty much mirror everything Chad said. <clears throat> I'll give it a three as well. <clears throat> Excuse me. It tastes it tastes and smells like like spaghetti sauce or like a tomato soup mm -hmm. with a kick. Mm hmm and That's, that's all it is. That's really what all it is. I, I don't want, maybe that's why I gave it the four because I don't, I don't mind that over tomatoey taste. I, I like tomatoes, so maybe that's why I gave it the four too. Mm -hmm. so. I don't know, I just feel like salsa should taste like something else. Yeah, yeah, okay. no, and, 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 and that's my thing. You like that garden, that more gardeny rich taste where yeah. you, you taste peppers and tomatoes. Yeah, and maybe a little bit of onion and mm -hmm. so on. Not so just, yeah, tomato. not just one flavor palette. Yeah. Even, even like, man, throw a red tomato, I mean, a red onion in there, maybe, like, <laughs> mix it up. 
That yeah. would sweeten it. All right, well, I guess we're, we're pretty done with that one. Let's go on to this one. All right. I don't want to butcher this name. Is not Calitos? Calitos? Kilitos. I was like, it's Kailitos. Kailitos? Kailitos. 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 Salsa. It's a little homie. Yeah, a little. I like it because the little guy has a little homie on the side of it. They give you their heat scale with the him filled in. So, has a lot of coolness to it. Um, what does it say? Coma Kailitos and todo. Eat Kailitos with everything. Ah. So, this is supposed to be, it's, it's branded as... I put that shit on, on everything. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. Which I I never trust these scales anymore. You can't trust yeah, these yeah, yeah. Because I, I'm like, what are you basing this off of? Then like, who's doing these taste tests? Like people that never eat salsa and they're just like, my god, this is like the spiciest, right? Well, uh, just overall mm -hmm. reference, you might not like this one as much as as the last one because it's just the first ingredients: tomatoes. Tomatoes. No, yes. but but most uh, things have tomato. Hold on, yeah, most things have tomato. Man. Let me get through it because. Well, why don't we just open it? This is a lot of tomato with very little, la very little else. It's probably tomato, tomato is powder. Tomato. Yeah, that, that's what I was trying to tell you, but you don't want me to read. Nope. All right, fine. It's gonna be here forever. Even I, I can see you pour it up. Straight but, tomato. But I heard it pour it. Fucking make a bloody mary with. This. I heard it pour it and it just sounded watery. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, seriously. Yeah. yeah. I, I didn't, I didn't see it like when it came out, but it this just, is definitely heard more it. pureed than either two of those. Oh my like, god. There's no chunk to this. This is like just straight. Uh, would you like a smell of this? Oh, you. I don't know. I was gonna blow on it like if it was hot. <laughs> Come on, it was hot. Watch this be like the hottest one of all of them. We're all dying. No. Nah, no. I, 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 this would surprise. I would be very surprised. I'd be so surprised. <laughs> all right. Cheers. All right. Cheers. Come on. All right. Okay. So. As a ketchup, I could put that on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is, is this yeah. one, right? Is that one? Yeah. Okay, I was gonna say, like, as a I need more because I, I really got no flavor. <laughs> Bro, like, like, I, I, have, I got no flavor. As a ketchup, I could put this on everything. <laughs> this is like. As a hot like sauce, I'd be. As a, as a salsa, I'd be embarrassed to put it on anything. Literally, it's like watered down tomato sauce. Not even to, like. Whoa, okay. If you eat a lot more, there's like a small hint you like some more? of spiciness. But flavor wise, like, there's like almost no there's flavor. There's no. No it flavor. It's very now. watered down. Here. Let me, give it a, let me give it some kick. Let me give you some spice. <laughs> <laughs> it is very watery though, isn't you, it? You yeah. show some yeah. respect to Kaito's. Like, I'm telling you, like, your, your, your measurements all fucked. When he poured, it just sounded so watery. Yeah. Like, it shouldn't sound like. It sounded like diarrhea. Yes! I was just gonna say that you beat me to it. <laughs> I'm giving this a one. a one. No, actually, no. I'm not giving it anything. No, I'll give it a one for the spice. They I'll give it a one, one because they can have a one for the spice. You just have to have a big scoop of it to get a little bit. I'm giving it a five as a ketchup and a one as a <laughs> salsa. You know what's funny? You know some people don't have this in other states, but. Waterburger makes a spicy ketchup. That is spicier than that. The mm. ketchup. Yeah. Honestly. Great. Yeah, like uh, and that's shameful? <laughs> Question mark. Right, you're a salsa, man. Uh I need y'all to like, you know, get some bleach and wipe this little guy out. If anything, it's up to his boots. It's up to the chunkless. It's up to his fur. <laughs> to the chunkless. Oh, he's wearing 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 He's not even wearing fucking boots. Yeah, it, it shouldn't be at the chest, it should be at the chancleless. Maybe at the tip of the sock, but <laughs> that's yeah, about it. Just like the base of the shoe. Yeah. I'll say this, this is giving me inspiration to maybe start eating my uh, tortilla chips with ketchup, though. Never. You know what, that salsa might be alright. If you put some real spice in it. It'll go good on some pupusas, like that red salsa that they give you with pupusas. Yeah, because pupusas salsa to me is weak. It's, it is. It's, very, it's very watery, too. Uh, sorry guys. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't know why. I'm like, sometimes I'm eating, I'm like, why is this a part of this? Yeah, it's so watery, like <laughs> it's just soggy. it's just making my pupusa soggy. Yeah. Like you're adding nothing to it. And that's just my personal opinion. Sorry, some of the Oh man, I want some pupusas. All in all, this is spice here. Mm -hmm. yeah. Well <sighs> I don't know guys. I probably wouldn't buy that. No. No. 
The only one I would think about rebuying again would be this one. Same really? here. Same yeah. here. I really, I really enjoy. I'm cool with this one. That one had, to me, a more complex flavor as a salsa. Yes, exactly. Okay. Yeah. It's chunky. Yes, but that's to me that's what I expect out of a chip okay. salsa. Yeah. Nope. I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna fury it. Go ahead. Bring it back for the rest of the class. Right. Well, well, guys, this is just what we found. Maybe y'all can send us some suggestions. We tried some spicier. Maybe these are the worst of the worst. Uh, we don't know. Yeah. Send us if you have some local salsas outside the state of Texas. Why don't you even um, send them to us? I don't know how you're going to do that. We'll figure it out if you decide to. P.O. Box. <laughs> or tell us what it is. Maybe we can order Scruff it. Scruff McGruff. <laughs> Chicago, they know. <laughs> also, make sure you like, share, subscribe as always. It helps us out a bunch. Um, we invite the comments and suggestions as always. <laughs> yeah, we're steady slowing and growing and you know again this is just really fun for us. Yeah. We got to now we found some new salsas. Mm -hmm. yeah. We appreciate everyone for all their attention they give us. But uh until next time. Number, Adios. number one, you know who you are. Keep watching. Yep. <laughs> <laughs>